let's call the meeting to order then. I'm Jeff Reiter. Um, I am uh, the current chair of the Planning Economic Development uh, Committee. Um, I'm joined today uh, by uh, committee member Stan Watson. Thanks for being here, Stan. Yes, sir, thank you. Glad to be here, sir. And um, first thing on our agenda is to consider the minutes of November 13th. Uh, Commissioner Watson, have you had a chance to take a look? Yes, Mr. Chairman, and uh, uh, my recommendation is that we uh, uh, like to make a motion that is to approve the minutes from that meeting. I'll second that motion, and uh, hearing no objection, uh, the minutes will stand approved. All right. The um, second thing on our agenda is uh, to consider um, a recommendation on the appointment of Michael Grover to the Perimeter Community Improvement District. Mr. Grover, please um, come join us at the table. And uh, just for the information of the uh, listening public, um, the, uh, the DeKalb County Board of Commissioners has uh, the authority to appoint a member to the Perimeter CID. Um, uh, who is a property uh, owner or representative of a property owner in the Community Improvement District. So uh, Mr. Grover has been nominated by the PCID's board for that role and it is our responsibility to interview him and make a recommendation. Um, also for the information of listeners, uh, Mr. Grover is the Executive Director of Governmental Affairs for Cox uh, Communications Incorporated who has a major presence um, in the perimeter CIDs. Um, in that role, he works in federal, state, and local policy and legislative matters, serves as an internal consultant on franchise renewal and compliance issues, serves on his company's PAC board, and monitors political contributions. Mr. Grover started his career in cable as an assistant corporate counsel on the, for the city of Detroit and uh, counsel to the city's cable commission. In 96, he joined Continental Cable Vision as director of legal affairs for the Midwest. Um, and after Continental, he, uh, after Continental became Media One, Michael added uh, government affairs duties to his portfolio. He moved to Georgia in 1999 and works for Media One, worked for Media One <coughs> at and and joined Cox in 2001. He's a graduate of the University of Michigan and the University of Detroit Law School. Um, and uh, let's see, Michael and his husband called uh, Atlanta, Georgia home. So thank you very much for being here today. And um, Commissioner Watson, do you have any questions? No, I'd just like to hear from Mr. Grover. I don't think I have against him. He's from Detroit, Michigan, but uh, seems like he's really qualified. Just your role at uh, Cox Broadcast. Uh, I, uh, uh, I actually work for the uh, Cox Communications, which is the cable side. Okay. The, uh, the television, radio, uh, Cox Media Group, television, radio, newspapers is a separate division. Uh, I, I, I don't work for for them and, and, and I, I am from, I grew up about 90 miles west of Detroit. I, I worked for the city of Detroit. I worked for uh, uh, Mayor Archer when Dennis Archer was mayor and, uh, and cut my teeth in <coughs> cable then mm -hmm. many years ago. It was a great job. Excellent. I guess the last question, Mr. Chairman, is that um, I know that we do a great deal of work in the perimeter and it's one of our uh, economic engines for the county and basically for the southeast. What do, you, what do you think some of the contributions, some of the things you like to work with the Perimeter CID board? Well, one of, uh, right now, uh, as you may know, Cox Enterprises is, is in the process of building a fourth tower for Cox Communications over on their Central Park campus. And I am uh, on our company's <coughs> move committee representing the law and policy department, my department is okay. in the company to, to, to do that. Um, so I'll be involved in, in, in that process within the company. For the, for the overall, um, perimeter district. One of the reasons, and I was telling Commission, Commission Rader that I, having to explain that I moved from Decatur just up the street, just up the hill, okay. about three months ago to uh, Midtown Atlanta, and one of the reasons, one of the main reasons that we moved was to be closer to a MARTA station, uh, have a, a straighter MARTA shot. Uh, my, uh, my husband works for the AJC, so he takes it and just to the Dunwoody and walks across the street. When we build that new tower for Cox Enterprises, uh, I would like to have the same opportunity to just have a simple walk to the office. So one of my key questions uh, and, and interests will be making sure that the, um, that the pedestrian uses and that there, it's uh, uh, much more usable for folks who want to sure. take public transportation and, and, and walk uh, the, the pieces of the perimeter and get to places. Good. Well, we certainly appreciate the contribution that the CID makes to um, 
the economy of DeKalb County. Yeah. And um, so uh, given uh, the confidence that uh, the board and uh, your company has placed in you, I think that um, we certainly um, would uh, do well to take advantage of your services. So is there, uh, is there a motion? Yes, Mr. Chair, I'd like to make a motion that we uh, uh, make a motion that we appoint Mr. Michael Grover to the Perimeter uh, Community Improvement District and make a recommendation to the full board of this confirmation. Okay, so the motion is to recommend confirmation of Mr. Grover as a member of the Perimeter CID uh, board for the cab side. Sure. Um, if there is no further discussion, all in favor say aye. 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 All opposed, like sign. With that, I think that we're done. Thank you very much. I Thank really you. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Is there any other business to come before the meeting? Anything I know. Okay. Next meeting, we're going to have to talk about the planning calendar. But it'll be Again? Well, it wasn't approved in December, was it? Mm -hmm. It was. It, it was, was and then we approved a. Um, Amendment, too. Yeah. Okay, okay, well, in such mm -hmm. cases, the minutes are good. Okay, thank you. Uh, thank you. Is it to get on the agenda on which date? Uh, I think that it is already on the agenda for well, our next, next meeting. Which is next Tuesday? That's right. And, um, and that starts at 10, 10 a.m.? Uh, yes, so, right. And y'all do your appointments on the front end? That's right. Okay. Mm -hmm. I really appreciate that. Although, it, dep yeah. it depends pretty much on how many people we have for public speaking. The oh, yeah. Okay, but let's let's we confirm that that gets on the agenda because I know agenda. that we had deferred it. Okay, okay. great. Yeah. Okay. Is it is it is it expected that I be there? Um, it is not essential that you be there. However, if you don't want to be there, you may want to spend some time calling the other commissioners. Okay. Right. okay. Fair enough. Thank you. Okay. Thank I think you. that there should be no problem, but um, right. one or the other. Thank you very much. All right. Thank you. Okay. So there's no other business on the agenda. Um, well, I'd like to take a point of personal privilege since I won't be serving on this uh, committee um, after today. I'd like to say thank you to everyone who has been a faithful follower of the committee. I hope that we have not disappointed you and um, that uh, you will continue to uh, follow the committee and its activities. So if there is no further business or objection, we can consider this meeting uh, adjourned.